What's our next adventure? Baltimore. We're heading off to Baltimore. We're here with our little man. We're very happy to have him here with us tonight. We're headed off to Baltimore, so we are about to get into the air. Matt's there, our little one is there. We're gonna have a hopefully a really great time. We'll see you guys when we hit the land. We are in Baltimore. Just outside of downtown. Yep. Just outside of downtown, and we are heading into the downtown. And uh, we're gonna see what we can see. Look at that, Barnes & Noble. That is super cool. It's a Hard Rock Cafe and a Barnes & Noble. It's like an old, old plant. power plant. And whatever Phillips is, Phillips Seafood. We should totally go there. Our first stop in Baltimore here is going to be at the National Aquarium. So we're popping in to get some tickets to our National Aquarium building. It's right here. That is right on Baltimore Harbor. I gotta say that there's like an atmospheric music here that's really chill. I'm excited to go into this aquarium. We're not even inside yet. That's exciting. Wrangling a two year old. So we. We are inside the National Aquarium, and one cool thing that they do is that they don't allow strollers, so instead what they do is that you can check your stroller and they will give you a backpack. For free. For free. Megalodon mouth. <laughs> you get a great view of a submarine. USS Torsk. USS Taurus, T O R S K. And it looks like you can go down in it. This looks like a lot of fun. That is a big stingray. This will be interesting to see. Whoa! There goes a shark. And another shark. Man, these stingrays are huge. Oh, oh, this is about to mess up somebody's day. Boop. Well, this is cool. That's this. Look at that stingray. It's a different stingray than we saw earlier. And the shark. We have three sharks and four sharks. Oh, hi, Bruce. Hi, guy. Waliwa. Oh, man, it's so dark in here. So, just above this reef area is a whale skeleton. Wow. My camera's gonna have a hard time because I feel like a lot of things are gonna be low lighting. But look at all the colorful fish and their shorts. Up on the second floor now. And man, this place is way bigger than it looks like from the outside. You know, we got a few floors to go. It's really cool to look at though.
they have an area, they have an area where you can touch horseshoe crabs. There's horseshoe crabs and little baby stingray. And there's a horseshoe crab. This is definitely one of the cooler things I've seen. It's touch a jelly. You touch the top of a jellyfish. How cool! Shy Hamlet. Green turtle. Where's the turtle? Oh, there he is. Oh. That's a giant puffer fish. Hey guy, how you doing? Oh, hi guy. What up, Bob? Look at Ray. What you got to say, bro? Oh, hi. Scratch, 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 scratch. Oh, look at this guy. Look at that guy. Pretty cool guy. I like you, dude. You like me too? I know, right? Check out this giant guy. Hey, big boy. Hi, Cannon. How you doing? Yeah, you're in the middle of nowhere there. Oh, there's one back there on the um, ground. Oh, yeah. With a quick escalator ride, we are now in the rainforest. Tropical rainforest. Oh, yeah. Those are definitely piranhas. interactive portion of the visit. Woo! Carrying an extra 30 pounds there, bub. This is pretty cool so far. That's what we saw at the very beginning. Cool place. What area are we in now? We're in the Australia, uh, Australia exhibit. I do want to hit that CBS pharmacy on our way out. Okay. Hey, look, the long one. Oh, cool. Look at that crawfish. Blue crawfish. So here's the gift shop, and guess what I found is a spirit jersey. Some veggie stuff, some, ooh, it's bees wrap, $11.99. This is 
uh, reusable food wraps that are made out of beeswax and cloth. And of course, the t-shirts galore. The soul of an All about the t-shirts. Oh, I like that one too. Pretty nice. How much is it? It's $78. <laughs> Woof. Lots of cute stuff. I like the I like the little bottles up above. All right, we've made it out of the aquarium. Mm -hmm. You guys saw pretty much everything there was to, to show. Now we're just kind of walking around Baltimore. Yep. What does this smell like right now? What am I smelling? It smells like burgers? Yeah, that's, that's fresh burgers right there. Burgers oh, or well, steak well, or something? Steak right right next to Fogo de Chow. So Fogo de Chow, yeah. Like they're, uh... <laughs> what are these? I gotta know what these are. What are these? Oh my gosh. I want all of them. <laughs> that would be so much fun to be on. Of course, not when it's, it's kind of raining right now, so. Pirate ship invade Baltimore's inner harbor on, a, on an electric pirate ship. It says down here. <laughs> Built up moss. <laughs> These are great. Kids and adults, up to six passengers. I, I would do this. That would be so fun. Between the aquarium and the other historic areas of the inner harbor of Baltimore is the World Trade Center, Baltimore. And here's a piece from the buildings. Hi. Uh, do mine eyes deceive me or do I see dragons? Or maybe we should call them sea, yeah, sea serpents. That'd be better. Uh, I really don't know which one I would choose. You know what I would do? I'd have two groups of friends. Oh, these are just paddle. Oh, it's windy. It is so windy. I'm so sorry for the vo vocals on this one, but these are just paddle boats. The other ones were electric boats. And this is where we're walking over to, which is the USS Constellation Museum. And I think they do tours. Uh, and they have tickets to go on board. I don't know if we'll, we will go on board for this, but we'll get a closer look. So the USS Constellation and others, as you can see, there's part of the historic ships that are on the harbor here. Uh, yeah, looks like they have a bunch of fun stuff. Food in the Navy, brace the yards, gun drill, join a gun crew and learn to operate one of the ship's great guns. So, yeah, so uh, here we are at the USS Const Constellation. It looks really flippin' cool though. And then we are now across the harbor from the aquarium. So there's the National Aquarium. Sorry, I'm trying to make a wind shear here. Oh. So that's, there's the aquarium with the, uh, the I almost said U-boat because there's a U-boat in Chicago, uh, with the wonderful uh, submarine. I believe these are replicas, baby, but saying, yeah. Replicas are 40 pounders. It could be. It's really impressive, though. Oh, yeah. You see it's modernized. They got the, uh, the discharging. Wonder what it would look like with sails on it. Because I don't think there are any oh, canvas. No canvas. But I wonder what it would look like with canvas on it. It's pretty sweet, though. Yeah, we got the <laughs> USS. Sorry, the USS Constellation. And then right across the way from Ripley's, believe it or not. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty funny. Talk about a wow! One heck of a thing to walk up to, you know what I mean? Yeah. They're just like, oh, it's a wonderful little harp. Whoa! <laughs> cool ship. Very cool ship. We just stepped across the road from the harbor into the gallery. It's just, it's a mall. I don't really know what's in here, but it's a pretty cool looking mall. This reminds me of somewhere that we've been before. I want to say it was like Minneapolis or something. Just the different tiers, different levels, and especially with the, the skylight. 
Yeah. I think my mom would dig this. Uh, my mom would dig this mall a lot. Especially with these, like, <laughs> random fishies in the center here. But yeah. So we're gonna walk around the mall. You ready to walk around the mall? There's Starbucks on level two. Starbucks on level two. I like this. After after a good amount of shopping, uh, we, because there, there wasn't anything spectacular to show in that mall, just besides the design of the mall itself, we are now headed off to go see family. So we have some family just north of Baltimore that we're going to be staying with. It's going to take us about an hour to get their home, and we're going to hang out with them for the rest of the night. It's kind of early in the day still. It's only about 2.45, and... We're just kind of palling around, but we have been up since four, so we're kind of tired. Uh, so we're gonna go home and not go home. We'll go to we're gonna go to our family place and have just kind of an evening, kind of a chill evening. Tomorrow we'll be more exploring and more figuring out what we want to do. It'll be fun.